So in terms of steaming a wig, you wanna make sure, first of all, you're gonna roll the wig first. So this is one of the bird wigs. Um, I've already rolled this, hopefully my camera doesn't fall. <laughs> but um, I rolled it up and then I got the steamer, trying to steam it on and we're gonna steam each curl, each roller for between eight and 10 seconds. So I will literally go start at the back or start at the front and I will count one, two, three, four, all the way up to eight. I've already steamed this wig, so I'm not gonna make you sit through this, but I went through each roller, 10 seconds. And you wanna make sure you get every single roller. I usually try to start at the very back and like the corner or start at the very front and work my way in the row all the way around because it's gonna piss you off if you steam the entire wig and forget one roller because all of the wig is gonna be curly and set except for that one roller and then you can't just go isolate that one section and curl it again because when you stick the steam to that one section it's going to melt down all the other curls that you've done. So make sure you curl every single roller and then you're gonna let it sit for at least 30 minutes. I say 30 minutes to an hour because the idea is that you wanna get the curls hot with the steam because it reshapes and reforms the curl. And then you want to let it sit and cool so that that curl holds. Just like if you were curling your hair with a curling iron or a curling wand, you wanna hold the curls until they cool off. Same thing, you just wanna steam it, let these cool off, and then you can take the rollers out out and let them um and then style it so i just steamed this one i need to let this one sit so i just wanted to go over the process of steaming a wig for you all right 